Hello folks, this is Ryan the Tech Guy, and today we're going to be discussing removing your login password for your Windows 10. Uh, in Microsoft's continuing move towards having a more secure operating system and having all of the operating system bells and whistles, they are forcing on the password by default and it's not necessarily clear on how to remove it. So this video is going to be very short. Uh, first thing you want to do is click on your start flag in the lower left hand corner and then select settings from the menu. Uh, when you load settings it will bring up the settings menu. Go ahead and click on accounts. Uh, the first thing as you can see I'm already set up with a local account. If you sign in using your Microsoft account you will not be able to remove your password. So step one for you will be to switching to a local account. Uh, after you do that, you can uh, go ahead and do the sign-in options on the left here. And for the password, you're, if you're already using one, this button will most likely say change. What you want to do is either click add or change. And when it's telling you to bring up a new password, this is essentially their, their new password screen. And nowhere on here does it instruct you how to have nothing as a password in case that's what you wanted. So when you get to this screen, you just want to go ahead and click next and then finish. And now your password has been changed. Uh, I, of course, changed it to nothing. So when I log in, when I boot my system up, it'll go right to the Windows desktop. There will be no need to enter a password. 